and welcome back to a brand new episode of Mafia 2 Definitive Edition. Chapter 12, Sea Gift, 1951. My house burned to the ground, along with almost every penny I had. There was even some trouble with the cops, but Eddie took care of that. And since I didn't have any insurance, I had to live in this shithole of an apartment till I could get back on my feet. At least I managed to save Leo. He disappeared without a trace. I doubt Frank Vinci even knew where he went. And even though Henry failed to deliver on the contract, Eddie still brought him in when he heard Leo had skipped town. Me and Joe had a new partner. There's the phone. Hey, Vito. It's Henry. Hey. Listen, I'm setting up something big. I want you to come in on it. If you're interested in hearing more, come meet me at Lincoln Park and bring a piece. Okay. I'll see you there. Okay. We have no money, though. So we can't go get one, so hopefully we have one. The shirt, um, that we bought is gone. Interesting. Yeah, we can't see what weapons we have. Okay, so we got three different guns right now. What happens if we go out with anything? I do this a lot, because I'm expecting their to let them to like hide something up there for you to like discover but there usually isn't well there is one of these That car is broken down. We can't take that. Is this our garage? I, I don't know. It is. Never really looked at any of these stats on it. Any of these cars. Okay, where are we going? Probably going to get marked. It's not going to show up now because we're back here. The road lines are really weird. I've just noticed that. Because you got white down the center and then yellow on the edge of the road. Hey. It's like opposite of what it like is now. You would have yellow dividing the lanes of travel. While white would be along the edge of the road. So white would also be in between the same direction of travel. So like here it makes sense. It's like cause here you got white down between the two lanes, then yellow over here in the middle. I don't know, maybe that was just a one way back there. Now see, cause here it's two ways and it's white down the middle and then yellow on the edge of the right. It doesn't really matter. I just think it's interesting. I don't know if that's how the roads were back then. I 
just an observation that I kind of made on the spot. We are here. Hey, here he comes. Hey! What's up? Hey, Vito. Take a seat. All right, listen. I've been doing some research into Carlos business. So? So, the only reason he had Clemente killed was because he was selling dope too and he was stealing his customers. Now he just needs to get rid of one last obstacle. The one guy who could fuck things up and ruin his plan to become the main supplier for the whole city. Frank Vinci. Where'd you get all this? I talked to a few people I trust. Okay, so what does this have to do with us? Cause, if he can do it, why can't we? A kilo of heroin costs 2,500 bucks over in France. Then it's another thousand bucks to get it here. And? And we pick up 11 grand for just driving the stuff to the dealers. That's 7,500 bucks profit a mm. kilo. Yeah, but what about Falcone? Carlo won't find out. And even if he does, he'll just threaten us and demand a cut. All right, but if Carlo's the only big supplier in the city, where are you going to buy the stuff from? I'm way ahead of you. What do you two know about the Tongs? The Chinks? Some kind of organization for Chinese immigrants, right? That's what I said, the Chinks. Right, but it's also a front for their other operations. They run the Chinese quarter, and they keep to themselves. But some of them are interested in doing business with outsiders, and they need middlemen since most people are afraid to deal with them. And we're the middlemen. Yep. They'll give us 10 kilos to start. For how much? 35 grand. And we can sell it for? 110. <whistles> nice. OK, well, where the hell are we going to get our hands on 35 grand? I know a loan shark, the Yid over on Palisade. I think a loan is 35 if we give him 45 back. Now that means our take is over 20 grand a piece. Not bad for just moving the shit from one place to another. But you know, who's gonna end up using this crap? What do you care? As long as it isn't an outlet. Of course, Vinci was right. Drugs are bad news, they kill people. Look, only idiots do drugs. Deadbeats and losers. If they want to kill themselves so badly, I'd gladly help them out. Especially for 20 grand. I got buyers in the ghetto. They'll take care of the distribution. So we don't need to worry about that. Are you guys in or not? I'm in. Come on, don't be stupid, Vito. Twenty fucking grand in one afternoon. <sighs> when? Right now. If we don't take the offer, the Tongs will just find somebody else. Come on, Vito. It'll be a piece of cake. Let's go see Bruno then. Vito, how about you run us all down there? He's on Palisade Street. Okay, let's go. Okay, where did I park? That would be... Yeah, this way. Yeah, okay, I see the car now. And so where are we going? Down to the docks. So who's this guy we're gonna see, Henry? His name's Bruno. He's one of the only guys in town who could do a loan this big. What if he doesn't give it to us, then what? Then the deal's off. But don't worry, I know this guy. He'll give us the money. There ain't nobody else we can get this kind of money from? There's three of the guys I know of. But if you wanna ask Carlo or Frank Vinci for 35 grand, be my guest. Yeah, no thanks. Who's the third guy? He ain't in business no more. Somebody blew up a room full of his guys and shot him point blank in the face with a Tommy gun. Oh, that guy. That was totally uh, not us. I wasn't gonna talk about that. All right, so, Henry, what is this guy, Rich or something? I think he gets his money from some of the bosses from out of town who sit on the commission. Yeah? No shit. Yeah, which is why we can't stiff the guy. Besides, we gotta keep this quiet. Can we trust him? Sure. Wise guy's been borrowing money from this guy forever. 
As long as we pay him back on time, we won't have a problem. We are almost here, right around the corner. All right, stop right here, Beetle. Is it out here, or are we out on the back? I think we oh, caught. Oh, oops. Fault. Actually, it was my fault, but hey, you want to take the blame for it. Fine by me. Probably are going to have to come around the back here. Yep. Hi, fellas. We're here to see Bruno. Hiya, Henry. If you got guns on you... Put them down there. I gotta search this. Hiya, Bruno. Hello, Henry. So, to what do I owe the pleasure of your company today? I need 35 grand in $20 bills. Oh, that's a lot of money, Henry. A lot of money, tell me. Why should I give that much to a small-time guy like you, huh? Convince me. I got a sure thing. You'll have 45 by the end of the week. What kind of sure thing? Sorry, Bruno. That's a trade secret. Then 45 is not enough. I'd be more comfortable with 65. That's a bit steep, even for you. 50 is all I can do. Henry, Henry, I have no guarantee I'll get my money back. And you have nowhere else to go. So, how about 60? Don't think of it as interest. It's more like my cut of the profits. 55, final offer. Anything more than that, it's not worth my time. Deal. I'll give you $35,000 today, and you'll give me 55000 by Friday. If you don't pay it back by then... The debt goes up by 10,000 every week. You'll get it by Friday. Okay. Isaac, prepare $35,000 and $20 bills. I have a feeling now, this you know, plan's gonna go Henry, south. But if you screw me, remember these wise words from the Bible. And my wrath shall wax hot. And I will kill you with the sword, and your wives shall be widows, and your children fatherless. Exodus, chapter 22, verse 24. <laughs> I'm impressed. You don't seem like the church-going type. Uh, but just remember, the money isn't mine. So even if you get rid of me, that doesn't get rid of your debt. So no funny business, okay, boys? Sure, Bruno. Thank you, Isaac. You want to count it, Henry? I'll take your word for it, and I'll bring it back on Friday along with your cut. I hope so. Good luck, boys. Yeah, this plan is definitely going to go south. Okay, yeah, this way... job, Henry. Of course. I told you to give us the dough, didn't I? How come you know the Bible so good, Henry? You read it or something? Bruno always uses the same quote. I go to church on Sunday, so I asked the priest one time. You go to church? <laughs> yeah, and I can understand why you don't. They use big words, there's no hookers, and the fool's lousy. Yeah, that pretty much sums it up. <laughs> yeah, Jeez, he's not wrong. 45. What? That time your mother made you go to confession? Yeah, that time she smacked me for checking out some chick's school. 
Ah, God rest his soul. How about you, Joe? How long's it been? Easter. Ah, oh, that ain't too bad. 1941. I take that back then. You're going straight to hell. What? Yep. He's figuring that out now? Don't worry. I'll save seats for the both of you. You know, I heard about a loan shark named Bruno once. Must be the same guy. Yeah? What'd you hear? Well, you know Mickey the Crab, right? What, the guy who cleans the bathrooms at Carlos Joint? Yeah, the guy who's only got a finger and a thumb on his left hand. Guess how that happened? I heard he owed a lot of money to some yid from Southport. Get my drift? Oh, right. I get the picture. Haha, <laughs> don't worry, though. Crab's a moron. Not like that's gonna happen to us. We are running out of fuel. Okay. That's interesting. They have a uh, fuel mechanic to the game. I see the light blinking down there now on the gauge. And, uh, yeah, I have no money. Guess we'll just have to steal a new car once we run out. Almost there. Drive through the gate and into the yard. All right, follow me, fellas, and let me do all the talking. Hey, we got some business with your boss. Greetings, Mr. Tomasino. This looks like it could be set up for a shootout. We got some crates there. This doesn't look like there's too much cover, though. Welcome, Henry. Hello, Mr. Wang. Let us get straight to business. Is your suitcase heavy enough? See for yourself. Yo, da, this is a of the Earth's yuan Jin Cao Piao. It's about 35,000 yuan. All right, take it away and bring the goods. You're a good man, Henry. Here is your merchandise. Each bag contains one kilo. Each kilo weighs a little more than two pounds. Which one do you want to test? Okay, we're good. I'm glad. Next time, we can give you twice the amount. It was a pleasure doing business with you, Mr. Wang. The pleasure was all mine.
Knock it off. See how easy that was. Let's get back in the car. <laughs> All right, fellas, the hot pot's over. Now we just gotta make the exchange and we're done. Sounds good to me. Where are we headed? Hunters. I got it all lined up. Hello, gentlemen. Fucking sick. I think you have something for us. Drop the suitcases. Told ya. Hmm. Nice shoes. Wait a minute, these guys ain't cops? Kill the bastard! Shoot, Vito! Vito, watch our back. Back me up, Vito. Come on! Here comes more of them! Hold on. I got them. Nice! Oh, shit! shit. Too Go too back that way. Run! Huh, get... Move your asses! We're going up here? Vito, watch our back. I can't see anyone. Stay away from these windows, fellas. Damn it! No sense staying up here. Let's get down here. Vito, kick the door in. Get. Can I take any of these people out or what? Let's go already. Kick it in. I can't. Let's go. I, chop, chop. I just. But where? You can't see anyone from over there. He's mine. What are you scared, asshole? Man, I'm doing like nothing here. Are you like not supposed to take him out? Like I. It doesn't seem like you're supposed to be able to take him out. Is that the fucking best you got? Oh, you're in Where are they? <clears throat> I don't see it. So there's someone over there, maybe. Did I get one. I gotta do everything. Come on, fuck you! Yeah, bring it on. Come on, take the shot. Hurry up here. It's fucking over. Hey, there's someone. I got him. Hey, I'm right back. here, scumbag. I think I'm gonna have to go down. I can't. I can't just. I just can't see anyone from up there. Oh, okay. I see. I see. Move. Move. Back me up, Vito. Oh, that's the best you got. Come on. You okay? Come out. Ah, just a scratch. Yeah. All right. All right. Let's go. Let's go. 
But now that I got in position to shoot this guy, he just he moved. Hey, I got something for you. Come on, where are you? Show yours. Let's go, Vito. Hurry up. I'm gonna be late for dinner. <laughs> Not bad, eh? Come on, I'll Stay sharp, Vito. <laughs> I'll cover your movement. Got him. Shoot that guy. Uh, we got maybe two more. I see one here. I won't want to get on your bad side. There's one more, and he's back Man, there. Oh, I mean, I think I hit him. Oh, come on! Okay. Right, fellas, the the last now we just guy. Exchange and we're done. Sounds good to me. Where are we headed? Hunters. I got it all lined up. Hello, gentlemen. Fucking set I think you have something for us. Drop the suitcases. Hmm. Nice shoes. Wait a minute. These guys ain't cops. Kill the bastard! Shoot, Vito! Vito, watch our back. I'm going in. Eat that asshole! Here Hold comes on. more of them. I got them. Hold on. Be nice. But there's still too many of them. Come on. Nice! There's still too many of them. Come on! Stay away from these windows, fellas. Damn it, Vito! No sense Take staying that. up here. Vito! Kick the door in! Here we go. Here we go. I got one. Okay, I see you. I see you. I missed you. Come out. Come out wherever you are. There's just so much stuff in here, it makes it really hard to be able to see. I'll cover your Shit, you're right. Take a lot more than that. You boys okay? Did I get him? I got him. Come on, think of something. Hurry up here. Come on, Back me shoot. up, Vito. Oh, yeah. Where is he? Looks like he's below us. Get him? I don't think I got him.
You shoot like my sister. There's two guys down there. Ah! That's where I wanted to go. I am right here, scumbag. He's mine. Let's go. Catch up. You okay? We'll get him. Bingo. Got you covered. Shoot him. Move. Come on. Fuck you. Yeah. Bring it on. This guy back here is still alive, the one that I shot. What are you scared, asshole? Get down. Going in. Die already, you bastard. I wish you Get would. Okay. One more. I prefer this gun. So tough now, are you? See if we can just get some more ammo. Now we got the real cops. Oh, I guess not. Good shoot. Both I was hoping I could blow up the car. Okay, I guess that's not so much. I thought that was... There is someone back there. I was right. Someone up over that way. I'll cover you, move it! That's the guy I wanted to get. I saw kind of up here. This guy. Here we go. Nice one. Okay, now I feel a little bit more comfortable working my way out a bit. Okay, see you. Come out of your hole, you fucking rat. I thought I could maybe blow that up. This guy looks glitched. The other guy, I see you. Come out and come out. I've got a present for you. It's my bullets.
I can't take this for cover. Haha. Uh -huh. Okay, so we have to now drive somewhere reasonably far away. Ammo, ammo, any ammo. They're still just like hanging out in cover like there's someone there. Weird that I couldn't do that with the car. Shit, that was fucking close. It's not over yet. They're coming after us. Fuck, lose them. Somebody shoot him, please. Especially since there's people with guns trying to kill us. Now our shot up and destroyed car will arise no suspicion from the police at all. What the fuck was that, Henry? No idea. Somebody else must have known about the deal. Those definitely weren't real cops. Maybe it was the chinks trying to fuck us. I doubt it. Look, I'll figure it out. But first, we gotta unload this stuff. Vito, take us to the old warehouse in Hunters. All right. I hope this deal goes better than the last one. It will. Not like it can go any worse, right? So who are we selling the stuff to? Uh, a bunch of different guys. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What do you mean a bunch of different guys? A bunch of different guys. What did all that shooting back there make you deaf? I thought you said we were just moving this garbage from one place to another. Yeah, well, you make a lot more money if you sell it in smaller amounts. Would have been really nice to know before I agreed to go in on this. If I did, from the way you were talking back in the park, you probably wouldn't have. Yeah, exactly. Hey. The best you can hope for right now is to spend the next 30 years of your life breaking your ass for Eddie and Carla before you either get bumped off or end up back in the can. The only time you're ever going to see cash like this is if you stick your neck out. Besides, I ever steer you wrong? Well, there was the OPA job. And that time we almost got killed when we wiped that fat fucking sand island. All right, all right, enough. None of that matters after today. Let's just get the hunters. And don't worry, we're never going to have to see these scumbags again after today. Unless this turns into a regular thing for us. Well, all right, let's just concentrate on getting through this one before we go making plans like that, all right? Hey, I'm just saying. Vito's right. Let's just get through the rest of the day. After that, smooth sailing, fellas. I think we're almost there. Yeah, we are. Here we are. Let me do the talking. These are tough guys, so no wise-ass comments. All right, Joe? Hey, guys, how you doing? Hey, man. Come on in. <coughs> Shit! It smoke! Oh, fuck. <coughs> We did it! We hit the jackpot! Hey, 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 take it easy. We're not done yet. 
Lighten up, will you, Henry? What's the matter? All of a sudden, money don't make you happy? After we pay back Bruno and you get your cut, then you can be happy. All right, all right. No sound again. I don't look good. Chapter 13, Exit the Dragon. Joe's apartment, September 24th, 1951. You ain't even gonna give me a tip? You want a tip? I'll give you a tip. Don't let the door hit you in the ass on the way out. Always the gentleman, <laughs> huh, Joey? Just get the fuck out of here hey, already. Gina, wanna come join me? Hey, I hope there's room for three in there. Okay, so we have five hundred dollars now. I thought we were supposed to get a lot more from that whole ordeal. Can't talk to you. See anything around? Still got that uh sofa in the kitchen. Grab some food or drinks. We don't need to. And we can't go in there. I still think it's weird that it's pink. I I just don't see Joe being someone that would have their living room pink like this. It just doesn't really fit his character. Barbaro's Bordello. You got the money, we got the honeys. Vito, it's Henry. We got a problem. What kind of problem? Eddie paid me a visit. Carlo knows about the deal, and he sent Eddie to pick up his cut. Uh, how much? 60 grand. Fuck, how much? What are we gonna do? I don't know. We don't even have enough left for Bruno. Meet me in the park. I don't want to talk about this over the phone. Okay. I'll be right there. Joe, we gotta go. What for? Now, Joe. I'll tell you on the way. Okay, so that's why we only have 500, because we haven't completed the whole deal and everything. I probably should have just gone left. Yeah, that's what I wanted. Let's go. Is he coming? Oops. Okay, that was weird. I guess we're going on our own. 
Maybe he'll come out here. Once we get outside. Yep, and he just magically appears. Okay, we are here. Henry's different these days. The guy's got a real. What the, what the fuck? fuck's going on? <laughs> Shit, that's Henry. <laughs> what the fuck are they hitting him with? Get on me! Get on me! Get on me! I hate how they just like Come stick on, you out out, out of cover up, there. I think I just shot him in the crotch. Fuck! Who the fuck does something like this, Vito? Them people are fucking sick. Shit! Who the fuck does something like this? Who do you think? God damn it, Henry! Damn it, Henry! Look at this, Vito. You fucking believe this? Yeah, the money's gone too. We're screwed. Joe, come on. We gotta get out of here. Cops will take care of him. Can put a couple bullets in him hey, real the quick? Guy who sold us the dope, Wong. Of all the ways to kill a guy, goddamn bullet would have been enough. These bastards are sick in the head, Vito. They're gonna fucking die. All of them. I mean, why do it like that? And in the middle of the park. Like I said, they're sick. I'm gonna turn them into chop fucking suey. Hey, not for nothing. We don't even know how many of them there are. Yeah, and it don't matter. Hey, Henry's dead. What, do you want us to get killed too? We gotta do this smart, Joe. It don't matter how we do it. As long as they're fucking dead when we're done. All right, listen. There's probably more than two of them. So what? The more, the fucking merrier. So it is only two of us. Unless maybe you want to call Carlo and tell him all about the mess we're in and ask him to send some guys over here. All right, fine. I get it. All right, so promise me you're not going to go in guns blazing as usual. We got to do this the smart way. All right. Where are they going? If I had to guess, I, I guess they'd be going back to where they were when we picked up the stuff. Down by the docks. They have seen us though when they drove past. It wouldn't be that hard to see then us following them. Like they should have seen us and knew we were there, and expected us to follow them. Now we know where to find. 
Let's get in there and take him out before he disappears with the money. Hold on, I'm gonna need some serious firepower first. We can either go to Harry's or we can kill these fucks right now. Just say the word. I think I'm good now. I've still got stuff from the last one. Is your fucking membership fee. God damn it, Joe. Can't you listen to me for once? No, I can't. You seen what they done to Henry. God damn it, Joe. You see? Why didn't you just bang the damn gun while you were at it? Right down, no, 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 wait. Get the air coat behind the bar. Far out already. Let's move here. Leave some of these little bastards for me. Okay, where are they? In the bar, I think. There's a lot there on the mini map, but I just don't know. They're shooting from up top. One over, yeah, one over there. It's over for you. Tell your boss I'm coming. Okay, I see. There's some up top there. I get this guy? I didn't think I would have got him. I hit him. But I didn't think I would have killed him. Say good night, Charlie Chan. Come on, Vito. Let's move up. See, but where are they? I got what? Four, I think, still on the mini map? Where'd Joe go? You fuck with the wrong guys, didn't you? I think they're like probably up here above me. Get the guy on the stairs. Yeah, they're they're exactly where I thought they were. Where are ya? Come out, come out, wherever you are. Oh, get there we go. Come on, you little bastards. One more. Okay, hey, where's the other guy? Come out and fight like man. Come on, how do you like that, huh? Where are you? Oh. 
can't even see where he's shooting from. Oh! Okay, I see him. Ah! Here's your fucking membership fee. God damn it, Joe. Can't you listen to me for once? No, I can't. You seen what they done to Henry. God damn it, Joe. You see? Why didn't you just bang the damn gun while you were at them? Right down. Help me waste these little fucks. Get the asshole behind the bar. Yeah, that other guy was up in there. I don't see the guys up there though now. Watch out! The fucking they goal. shoot from up top. You going to be dog meat? Uh, there's one. Is he dead? Come on! How do you like that, huh? Come on, Vito. Let's move up. Boy, my tongue. Get the guy on the stairs. Boy, up, up no, there in the window. Die, you piece of shit. Where are you? This is for Henry, you bastards! Come on, Vito, show them who they fucked with! That way I can just hopefully see him when he gets up in there. I don't think he's gone up there now. It's over for you. Come on, Vito, waste them all. Where the fuck are they all coming from? Must be a tunnel to China. Come on, you little fucks. Two more to go. That's it. Come on! Who taught you assholes how to shoot? Might have been this window. There's the two up here. You fuck with the wrong guys, didn't you? I didn't think he'd be able to shoot me from there. Like, he just hides in cover, though. Like, how am I supposed to shoot him? And if he can shoot me while I'm up against the wall coming up the stairs. Can't you listen to me for once? No, I can't. You've seen what they've done to Henry. 
God damn it, Joe. You see? Why didn't you just bang the damn gong while you were at it? You got right now. Guy, you cross. Die, you piece of shit. Lemos ya. Oh, nice shot. Watch out. They're shooting from up top. You little bastards! Okay, where is more? Say good night, Come on, Mr. Jerry. Big Man. Okay, come on. Come on, Vito. Let's move up. Come on, you little fucks. Get the guy on the stairs. Oh, get there. Up there in a window. <laughs> Did I get that guy? I think I got him. Who's getting me though now? I didn't get him. He's still alive. Come on, how do you like that? Come on, Vito, move for Christ's sake. Where are these other guys? Come on, chicken are you coming from? Must be a to China around here somewhere. Got them all. Let's see about some ammo. I can't go over that. I saw one gun fall. I don't know where it went though. Yeah, we got something there. Yeah, so like, I mean, this part has not really been hard so far, but it's just the guy's hiding behind cover up here in the window. He like wasn't coming out. All right, you go first, Vito. You're a smaller target. Thanks. Fat ass. Hey, you said we gotta do this smart, right? So it's up, Kuya Baton. You ain't so tough. Come on. Who taught you assholes how to shoot? Okay, there's a guy over here. Come on, Vito, waste them all. Uh, 
Uh, that guy is, I think, down. There, there's another one. Tell your boss I'm coming for him. So we gotta come over here. Where the hell is that prick? He's gotta be around here somewhere. I could have cut you to pieces! Keep going. Okay, what's back here? The boxes oh. keep on coming. How many more they got? Back? Don't matter. I got plenty of bullets left. Right between your slanty eyes. Okay, Joe just kind of took care of all of them. Nice. Okay. Shh! Be quiet, Vito. Since when are you concerned about making noise? There's too many of them. Just take them out nice and quiet. Yeah, he did say that. I wasn't listening, honestly. I'm going in. I heard him say it, but it just didn't really process what he said. Down there, you shoot like my sister. Hey, oh, I bought you, eh? Let's go, Vito. Come on. Get some health. I'm back. Back me up, Vito. Come on. Health. Oh, that's the best you got. Health, health, health. And up. Oh. 
Ugh. I get him. Still alive? Is that the same guy? I think it is. Maybe not. And we got what? I think it looks like one. Okay, maybe two. Because I don't think it was that guy that shot me. But somebody did. Okay, jeez, I almost died there. Need health bad. Okay, there's somebody over on the right side here. Okay, move, 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 move. Let me do this because you're not. Where is he? Okay, now he's going back this way. Oh, is he back here? Okay, maybe not. I thought I saw something pop up there. It just, it annoys me when it's like down to one. Shh, be quiet, Vito. Since when are you concerned about making noise? There's too many of them. Just take them out nice and quiet. Sneak through here. Okay, is there is there anyone else? That guy's gonna see me. How am I supposed to get through here without being seen? There we go. Yeah. There was like no way to go through there. Going in. Oh, what are you scared, asshole? Let's go, Vito. Like fucking cockroaches. That boy lad. Hot white gobin. Big mistake, fucking big. Come on, Marco Polo. Oh, another one bites the dust. Uh. 
Okay, it looks like there's only one left. Maybe two? Yeah, I see two. Oh, jeez. Okay, I Man, see you. Terrible fucking shot. It's over for you. Come on, you big man. Oh, hunker. Quite some door, leaving door. Okay, where is this guy, though? Koi say so may ah. Back me up. Here we go, Vito. Come on. All right, that was the last of them. See? Oh, okay. So, so far, right? Yeah, but what if somebody recognizes us and Carlo hears about it? That's why we ain't leaving no witnesses. There's probably more of them down here. Get ready. Come on, let's go, Vito. Get in the elevator. Once I get ammo, chill. Okay, I think that is it. How much more of this we gotta do? Slanty-eyed fuck! What is it that you want? <laughs> what the fuck do you think we want? We want to know why you had our friend killed. We also want the money you took from him. I had no choice. Your friend was a government informer. What, what? the fuck are you talking about? A contact inside the Federal Bureau of Narcotics told me that Henry Tomasino passed them information about our deal. That's a fucking lie! Whoa, whoa, whoa. You saying Henry was a rat? Yes. But not anymore. That's bullshit. Makes no sense. And I suppose you had nothing to do with the little stick-up after we closed the deal with you either, right? You think we would take such a stupid risk and destroy our own factory? That was just another reason to get rid of you. We had problems with you from the very beginning. Yeah. You ain't gonna have problems with me much longer. Now. So where's our money? It's not here anymore. What? Where the hell is it then? I cannot tell you. If you don't tell us, I'm gonna splatter your yellow brains all over this fucking room. If I told you, I'd be dead anyway. Find your choice. Are you crazy? What you want to do? Let him go or something? We could have gotten more out of him. Fuck that. He wouldn't have said nothing. These bastards are tough. <sighs> Let's just get the hell out of here before the cops come. Speaking about cops, are we going to have to shoot our way back out of here with the cops? What the hell are you doing? Get in the elevator. Looks like this place won't be opening up for a while. If we had the time, I'd burn it to the damn ground. Where you going, Vito? That's the way we came in. I thought that's the way we were going. Oh, okay. Ah, oh, 
fuck this. Come on, Vito, let's get out of here. There's too many of them. Find us a car, quick. This guy's a maniac. We gotta take him down. Copy that. Suspect is about six feet tall, dark hair, medium build. Ten four. Come on. And we're dead. There's too many. It takes too long to get into a car. Ah, oh, fuck this. Come on, Vito. Let's get this out. This guy's a maniac. There's we too gotta many take him down. Come on, this is a car. Quick. Copy that. And dead. Uh, you can't even get to the car. Ah, oh, fuck this! Come on, Vito, let's get out of here! There's too many of them! Find us a car, quick! I wonder if I just go out with... This guy's a maniac! We gotta take nope. him down! Ten four. I mean, he says there's too many of them. I, the, only, the only thing I, I can think of is we're going to have to shoot our way out. Ah, oh, fuck this. Come on, Vito. Let's get out of here. There's too many of them. Find us a car. Quick. This guy's a maniac. We got to take him down. Roger that. Going in. Is that the fucking best you got? Oh, oh, officer down. Oh. Officer down. Shoot this asshole. Oh, let's go. Captain. Ten four. I'm the best. Come on, show yourself. Go fucking Come on. Get in. Suspect is about six feet tall, dark hair, medium build. Get in. Roger that. We gotta go down and we gotta go left. All right. We lost him. This guy's a maniac. We gotta Vito. take him down. I need a fucking drink. Copy that. That was, uh, was fucked up, huh? Yeah. I don't want to talk about it. Gotta shake the Just cops. get me back to my place, could you? Someone. All right. Really? Gotta shake the cops. What's the whole point of those things, that? Trying to kill us? Jeez. Trying to avoid the cops. Relax, will you? Are you trying to hit every fucking car? Hey, well, I'm drive, trying to right? start at the mini map so I don't get called by cops. Okay. okay, so like, chill, man. You want to do this? Crap.
Okay, let's just... All units, code green, back to the station. Do this. There. This deal was a total fucking disaster. Tell me about it. Henry's dead. We don't have Bruno's money. We killed half the Tongs. And if they think Carlo sent us, it'll mean war. We're fucked. Yeah. And if Carlo finds out we got him into this mess... What if Henry really was a rat? No fucking way. Don't even say that. Look, first let's get the money for Bruno. That'll fix at least one problem. But I'm done for today. I need a drink. Call you in the morning. We'll figure this shit out. All right. Okay, I'll see you later. And Vito, be careful. Alright, so that's going to do it though for this episode of Mafia 2 Definitive Edition. If you enjoyed it, then leave a like. Thanks for watching, and until next time, so long everybody, and wow, we are glitching through the bad.